so this is our third installment of Caps and Cars, and we're with Josh Owings today. So how was practice? Oh, it was uh, a good practice. Just quick, quick one hour. So since you're driving and I have to make sure I'm safe in this vehicle, what's the process of getting your license in Michigan? <laughs> uh, when you're 15, you go to uh, driver's ed. I think you have to drive with a, like a, a teacher for like six drives. Then you get your pink slip, which is like an L here where you can drive with your parents and only like one other person. Then when you're 16, you just take a road test and you get your license. What's the story behind your car? How did it get here? This car? Oh, me and my three roommates last year bought it for like a thousand dollars. Hilarious. Did you name it? Uh, it's just the Green Goblin. So tell us a little bit about where you're from. Um, from uh, Ann Arbor, Michigan. You know, good university town. A lot more snow, sadly. It's colder. Yes, you're a fan of the Green Christmas. Oh, I'm very fan of the Green Christmas. The Green Christmas, for sure. So back at home, who is your family made up of? I have three brothers, and I have my mom and my dad. I have a dog. Are you the oldest or the youngest? I'm the third. What kind of music do you listen to while you're in the car? Uh, I listen to all music. Hip-hop, like techno, soul. I listen to everything. Even a little country sometimes. Whatever I'm in the mood for. What NHL team do you pull for? Detroit. Even though they suck this year. Still Detroit. What age did you start playing hockey at? Uh, I started skating around like three-ish. Probably like recreational hockey, like six. Can you step us through every team you've played for up until now? I'm a suitcase, so I don't really know. Uh, I played for uh, Detroit Compuair, Little Caesars, Honey Baked, uh, Wichita Falls Wildcats, and the Capitals I can think of in the last like five years probably, six years. Tell us what it's like to be playing with guys you've known for a long time. It's, uh, it's a lot of fun. You know, you have a lot more chemistry. Uh, it just makes your everyday, you know, every day to come into the rink a lot more enjoyable, knowing everyone. Who are your roommates while you're here? Uh, Jared Doman and Michael Montambo. What's the best part and the worst part about living with them? Best part? Uh, Monty makes breakfast every morning. Worst part? They're both dirty. <laughs> When you're not playing or practicing, what do you do in your spare time? You know, I uh, do a lot of Netflixing, a lot of hanging out with the boys, just kind of hanging out, just chilling with everyone. What are you watching right now? Oh, The Good Wife. Good show. As this is your second and final season with the Caps, what has been your favorite part about playing here? Um, you know, I love playing with the big stick. I love all the fans that come out and support us. Uh, I love Bob. Um, you know, most importantly, I love, you know, I've, I've loved both teams I've played on. Uh, everyone's a good group of guys. Have you had a highlight this season so far that has stood out to you? Hmm. Not yet. Uh, I hope we have a, I hope we have a highlight season at the end. What do you think is the biggest difference between last season and this season? Uh, we have a lot more older guys. Um, this year I play, I have a little different role. Last year I was a young guy you know, kind of getting told what to do. This year, I'm one of the older guys and, you know, part of the leadership group that uh, tries to help everyone get ready. And I don't know, I just, it's just a different role that I'm in this year than last year. What do you hope to accomplish in the rest of this season as a team and as an individual? Uh, as a team, I hope uh, I hope we can go deep into playoffs uh, as an individual. I uh, hope to get a Division One college commit so I can uh, continue my career. And is there something you're hoping to study if you go to school next year? Um, I am undecided. Uh, maybe something business. Uh, I don't know. I haven't, uh, I haven't really decided yet. Is there a message you want to give Caps fans and supporters? Um, yeah. Come to the games. We're going to get some wins for you and uh, be a good playoff team for you. Perfect. Perfect.